Hi everyone and welcome back to today's puzzle. For today's puzzle I took out the Schmidt 1000 pieces uh, Pink Beauty. That's the one I borrowed from a friend of mine and um, I love everything about this puzzle. It's a matte finish, it's a perfect fit, the image is beautiful, the artwork is just stunning. Um, everything about this was just a joy to assemble. This is a puzzle, I think the first one in a series of four by Ilona Rennie. She's the artist. But, um, but I'll talk to you during the course of the time lapse about the artist, the other puzzles, um, my thoughts process going into this. I thank you so much for your time. I hope you enjoy it. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. 1000 pieces Schmidt puzzle by Ilona Rennie um, she's a German artist and there's a couple of puzzles um, that seems like it's part of a series I th it's more than four initially I thought it's only four but there's more um, it appears that Hey Puzzles is also um, publishing her artwork as puzzles just to name a few others that are absolutely beautiful there's a blue one blue night sky there's one that's more green it's a parrot jungle there's one with um cats and fish and mice decorating with dreams all of them so detailed so beautiful it's just a pure joy to just look at her artwork so go check it out um See if you can get your hands on one of her puzzles. It's just a pleasure. If you go to the back of the box, they describe the artwork as follows. Ilona Rennie's illustrations takes us to an enchanted world of fantasy that are inhabited by little creatures. Fairies, insect plants, flowers, cats, flying fish, snowflakes and other things that follow their own laws of physics. They bring our imagination to life and inspire us to dream and reflect. Contemplating her images is a special form of re relaxation since there is always something new to discover in her themes. Her color composition is harmonious and pleasing to the eye and can help us unwind. I can definitely confirm. It was a pleasure to assemble her puzzle. I'm almost um, a quarter in here. So what I found best to easiest to start with was the the pink and the cages that was on top of the pink. Every cage has a, a different um texture, so it was easy enough to determine that cage in the middle there um has a like a cushion or a seat in the bottom. So that was um distinguishable enough. And from there, just everything that touches another thing is unique. There's a new texture to discover. There's a new thing to discover. Um, there's a bunch of birds, a whole lot of birds. Pink birds, there's like six or eight pink birds that looked more or less the same. So those were the only ones that was hard to determine where they went at any given time. There was three or four birds on the table and I wasn't sure where they went until much later in the puzzle. Um, eggs. There's eggs all over. Two blue eggs. There's, there's um, bubbles. There's snowflakes. There's plants. There's you know, everything you can think of and you won't realize that you are seeing it when you look at the puzzle the first time. All of this detail only gets discovered as you assemble the puzzle. Every piece you pick up and you discover, oh, but I haven't seen this yet. And then when you find it and it's like, oh, I haven't realized it's there. So I can just say that this was a joy. The quality of this puzzle was one of the best I've ever assembled. The image was a joy. Um, there's a matte finish to the pieces there's absolutely no shine so that helped a lot to contribute to the enjoyment of this puzzle no false fits I can't remember having one false fit so definitely 
a puzzle brand I will rec uh, recommend to anybody. It's an artist I will recommend to anybody. Um, I'm just sad that her puzzles and the Schmidt puzzles are not available to us in South Africa. So I will have to look for somebody that goes overseas and is willing to bring me back one. I'm absolutely willing to buy it. But you know, it might be a while before I get um, the opportunity to assemble another one of Ilona's um, puzzles. I appreciate your time. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the, the rest of the time lapse and um, I'll see you next time.